How has Art Show made an impact on PV over the years? Well, it's a, it's a tradition here at PV. Uh, it started in the 50s, um, and it used to involve the uh, construction and the woods classes and the culinary classes. It's funny, I, I called my mentor, Jim Mercadante, who um, was the teacher who taught me how to teach. He taught at PV here for 34 years, and he was you know, just the best person to learn how to teach art from. But he went to high school here and he taught here. Um, and actually he would, he would joke that he started teaching the week that I was born. So he started in the 70s and he was able to see how the art show changed over the course of four decades. Um, apparently it used to have a, um, a contest at the end of the event where there was like a beauty pageant which has nothing to do with art show but that's that's how far we've come from you know the time that art show started in the 50s and, and how it's developed to to present day so let's answer a question some of you may have in your mind right now what exactly is art show Art Show is a very colorful night indeed. The annual event at Basag Valley High School where artwork made by the students are praised by teachers, friends, and even family members. Students pursue their creative talents in the variety of art classes at PV. This includes drawing, foundations of art, portfolio, sculpture, painting, graphic design, and even photography. Art Show is one of the many exciting annual events at Passaic Valley High School, counting up many years of unforgettable history. And today, we'll be discussing the process of Art Show on May 24th, 2017. As the date of Art Show approaches, all art teachers begin to pick students from their classes to help set up the artwork in the Farrell Gym. The setup takes about four periods excusing the chosen students from their classes, requiring them to wear a t-shirt with the Art Show logo printed onto it. There is limited space for students setting up and there are requirements they must meet in order to be eligible. Uh, students are selected to set up, demonstrate, and break down the Art Show based on their grades, uh, based on their conduct in the art classes throughout the course of the year. Um, they have to be responsible, uh, able to work independently and follow directions. Well, I need someone who has not been absent a lot because I can't take them out of class to help set up if they've been absent a lot. And I need students that I know will be organized and I don't have to keep saying, uh, stay on task, stay on task. I need kids who will follow my directions. And I also need kids who have the ability to carry the products. Once set up for art show is complete, students are brought down from their English classes to the Faro Gym the following day to view the art pieces made by their friends who made it into art show. It's really exciting, you know, just to kind of stand in the background and overhear the conversations that are taking place about uh, the students' work. It's, it's like being a fly on the wall. And I really encourage our students to stand near their artwork so that they can hear or get some feedback um, about you know, the impact that their work makes on the public. The English teachers bring down their classes for the students to admire the fabulous artwork and even take an interest in asking the artists how their work was made and why. Ms. Miskovich and uh, Ms. Switlitsky they came up with a scavenger hunt assignment, which was just great. The kids were like rushing around trying to find all the work in their questionnaire. Um, Ms. Delano had this great uh, interview uh, process for her public speaking classes. It's just, it's so great to see kids uh, in the show, interacting, seeing what's going on, and seeing all the hard work. Finally, the main event starts later that night when the Pharaoh Gym opened the doors to parents, friends, and to the public for all to see. Oh, well, people start to trickle in, and you think it's going to be a mellow night, 
And then all you end up doing is talking to tons of parents, tons of students, and lots of former students. You hear what everybody's doing. The night flies by. You're on your feet talking to people all night, and it's really cool. Many people attend art show each year, including former Passaic Valley High School students, who show up to check out what this year's artists have to show, and even taking the chance of catching up with their teachers. I had two kids show up last night who graduated in 06. I mean, and one from 05. I mean, it's like when they see art shows uh, advertised on the marquee outside on Main Street, they know that, that their art teacher is going to be here that night. I get feedback from former students on what they think about the stuff. Uh, it's just it's a, it's a non-stop social two hours. It's really fun. Art show is an unforgettable night many wait eagerly as the rapture date approaches. The Faro Gym explodes with excitement as people walk in the door and fill the room. The next morning, more student helpers are called to take down Art Show and return the artwork back to the classes. The Faro Gym always looks different without the flashy colors everywhere you look. The PVR teachers can even agree to that statement. Happy and sad. Happy for the kids that they worked so hard and were able to get you know, their work out there, seen by their friends and their teachers and the public. But it's always sad. It's like a bittersweet moment. I'm always very content with how it works out. Uh, I'm very happy that I've been able to talk to a lot of the parents. I met some parents for the first time last night. I was very happy to see the students who came out. And um, it's, so, it, it, it's a nice way to end the week also. Um, I always drive home very happy. At the end of the year, students are given bags to bring their terrific artwork to hang up at home. These pieces of art will be forever remembered by the students as one of their many fantastic memories at Passaic Valley High School. The art teachers themselves are always satisfied with the students walking out of their classroom as an improved artist at the end of the year. <laughs>